so here is how I cook my American shad. So this one I already cleaned, like it's uh, everything's clean. Then we need to cut it to like very thin slices. Um, why? Because American shad have a lot of bones. So we want to cut it to like thin slice and then fry it. So now I put some salt into it. This is a lot for cooking. This is for clean. So because um, we want the blood of the fish to be pushed out uh, from the fish. So put some salt and we just squeeze the meat and make sure like uh, the blood is being squeezed out from the fish body. Yeah, so now we need to put something inside. So this is a black pepper. Black pepper. And this is a Chinese Chinese pepper. This uh, will make your mouth numb. We, I like this kind of a flavor, pepper. And then it's a sweet potato powder. It's right here. Oh, never mind. I'll clean it later. And some of the cooking sauce, uh, cooking wine. Then we mix them. So here is a pickled cabbage stripes. So um, it's kind of sour, like the um, kind of like the Korean cabbage, but it's a little bit different. And we will use this like uh, to give the fish. A little bit of sour uh, flavor. I like it a lot. So we need to wash it and just squeeze the water out for the little bit. Okay. We'll squeeze the water out. Ginger and garlic, we cut them all to small slices. So this is just a vegetable oil I get from Costco. So let's just put a lot of oil there. And yeah. So when you start to see like small bubbles come out from the bottom, the we then we can start to fry the fish. So now the oil it's kind of uh, warming up. Let's put the fish inside to fry. Yeah, I have to open the fan now. Okay, so this is a fish has been deep fried. So now we'll start the final cooker process. Okay, so this is the oil. 
We just got fried the fish and this is a ginger and a garlic. And this is a pickled uh, cabbage stripe. Let's put it inside. And uh, here is a uh, spicy soya bean sauce. Let's put one spoon inside. And here is a uh, cooking wine. And here is the water. And let it boil. Then we can put the fish back into it. So now let's put the fried fish back into the soup. Let's put the fire into a small one. So let it uh, cook for about uh, like 10 minutes. So now it's about like uh, 10 minutes. Let's put the green onion inside. and then turn off the gas and uh, wait for like uh, three minutes and we are good to go now you have a delicious shied fish for your dinner <laughs>